son. You wanted the stars. The stone circles show the gods' places in the sky. And your grandfather once told me they also show our place in the world. I'm going to find every stone circle. The Sphinx and the pyramids too. And I'll find my place. And you will have them. Peasants, make yourselves useful. Ah, they will attack on sight here. Ready? Yes. Oh, you made me miss. 
you. <laughs> Remu, come here. I found a Haini cave. A real one? Yes. Ah, go ahead. You're going to love it. There's like 16 hyenas. And they're so dark and scary. Well, you know what? Uh, I'd rather go hunt with my papa. You always get too scared. Hey. Hey, hey. Let's go on a real hunt. Huh? All right. <laughs> come, come. What are we hunting? The oracle wants the pelt of an ibex stag for the ceremony. You will stand next to the pharaoh, won't you, buddy? You're the magi. When I'm magi, I'll stand next to the pharaoh. You'll never be magi. Too scared. That's not true. What about the hyena kid? Shut up. Enough, you two. The sand is so hot on my feet. Sometimes they light on fire. It makes you faster. <laughs> It is up ahead. Can I come? <laughs> Your mother's waiting for you. All right. See you in the ceremony, Haru. The herd is around here. We don't want just any stag. We want the pack leader. Which one is he? Big. Giant horns. Quiet now. Do what I do. Ah! Oh no! I scared them. It's okay. Hit! Did you hurt him? A clean shot to the heart hardly hurts at all. Let us get that pelt. We will take this to the Oracle before it gets dark. One day, I want to shoot an arrow through the sun. <laughs> you can. Your arrow will have to become Senu. Imagine, all my arrows are Senus. Then I'll be able to hunt anything. You said you'd like to see the pharaoh up close. Yeah. What if you stand with me by his side? Can I do that? As my son and the future Magi, yes. Papa, what is a Magi really? The first Magi was a protector of the pharaoh. But now, it means you must protect all the people of Egypt. Not just protect them, but work for their well-being. Oh, Papa, I'm so excited to be Magi one day. You know all the secrets of Siwa. What if I never grow up to be a Magi? Ah, of course you will. You are my son. But I get scared. I try to be brave. But sometimes it's hard. Hold on. Let's go this way. When I was about your age, sometimes I got scared too. Your grandfather was a well-known Magi. And he wanted me to bring honor to the family when I succeeded him. Yeah? One day, he took me up this way. At the top, he said something to me. A single word. <laughs> it changed me. One word? I got over my fear. I knew I could do anything I needed to. What did he say? I will tell you once we are there. Jump. Don't think so long. Jump. Yes, Papa. Hey, trust me, you can. I do. I will. Uh, jump then. Come back. You're not ready. I can do it, Papa. I can. Shut up, you filthy little shit. Help! Help me! That's Shanjira! I said shut up! Run home to your mother. Chanjira will be fine. I will take care of it. Magi Bayek! Go! Now! I'm scared. I don't want to go home alone. Oh, Hemu, just do what I say, please! I'm indeed Magi here. 
Who summons me? Sheath your weapon and follow me. You said you only wanted to talk to him. Who are you to give commands to me? You piece of shit! We don't have time to piss away! Make a sound and you're dead. What took you so long? Didn't want to be seen, sir. Kept to the shadows. We are pleased you have joined us, Medjai. It is of great importance that we gain access to the vault. The temple priests stubbornly refuse to assist us. You are perhaps reluctant out of loyalty I to the Oracle. To we have question. someone to help convince you what otherwise. Quiet! I'm the lady. See that no one comes in. Oh, Camel! Are you hot? Go ahead. Try it your way. I'll leave my son out of there! Your son has something to explain to you. Would the Ibis show him the orb? We believe we need this to enter the vault. This is a waste of time! The boy is frightened! It's all right! Papa, they need you to tell them about the vault. They need to know how to use this. As measure, you must have some clue to your legend that explains its use. I don't know anything about this vault! Please leave my son out of this! He will be discovered, quickly! Talk to your son. If the vault isn't open when we return, you'll never see him again. It's all right, son. No? Papa, I can get it to you. What? No! Come on, don't! They're going to hurt us. Remo, tell. Remo. This foolish waste of time! Remo, Remo! No, I don't... Out of time? Tell us! Oh, I, I, I don't know. We must go now. I will cut the heart from the boy. No, no, wait, 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 wait. Stop. He will never know the afterlife. Uh. No, 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 I, I will tell you. I will tell you. Stop. I will tell you. No, no, no. for time. Stop. 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 This is your master. <laughs> the snake takes that as your answer. <laughs> Shh. 
We thought you were dead. You could not even save your own son. You are no one. By yak of nothing. Father to nobody! <laughs> Is a nobody! May the hidden one greet you. The Lord of the Duat awaits. Well done, my friend. Our hero returns. You brought joy to Siva. I should get to Alexandria. I need to see Aya. Don't be in too much of a hurry. Siva will always need its Magi. But you are the protector here now. I'm always pleased to help. Come see me when you are certain you are ready to go. We will drink beers to our friendship, huh? <laughs> Sure, you are ready before you go. I must leave Siwa. There are others to whom I must deliver justice, especially the one known as the Snake. How will you find these men? Aya has been tracking them in Alexandria. I must find her. She said she would be visiting her cousin at the Great Library. Great Library? And she said if you are coming to tell you one word Serapis. Serapis? The god that Greeks and Egyptians share. Of course, I see. And bike, do something about that beer. <laughs> Goodbye, my friend. Oh shit! Layla, you need a refill on Cyclosporin. Stat. Layla! Wakey, wakey! Don't make me come down there. Layla? Layla? <coughs> come on back. Layla, are you with me? Hepipti. I told you not to call me that. The thing is, the fastest way to get your attention is to piss you off. I'm paying attention. Okay, you need to take a break. The Animus is rejecting you. <sighs> I'm fine. Yes, but your kidneys aren't. Go add more cyclosporin before they shut down. Yes, Nurse Geary. That's medical officer Geary to you. So? How did it go? My mods are holding. Subject's memories are perfectly clear. If this doesn't convince Abstergo to give me a place on the Animus Project, nothing will. I oh, amazing! Who do you have in there? His name is Bayek of Siwa. The death of his son turned him into a killer. Think you'd be of interest, Abstergo? Don't start. You know, they're not going to be happy with how he handled this assignment. They know I don't work by the book. Well, this time you lit the book on fire and then stomped on it. Anyway, none of this will matter if you're comatose. Now go get that cyclosporin. Got the cyclosporin. Two CC should do it. Don't forget the alcohol wipe. I wish I was there to help. You do a good job looking after me, even from the hotel. And I know how you like your aircon. Come forth by day, and I will guide you home. Who are you talking to? By ex mummy. Real chatterbox, that one. Gladstone Kittredge Esquire. You're fucking kidding me. Dean never 
Bob puts in enough snacks. One bar. No, half a bar. Damn it, my papers went everywhere. Whoops, anything important? Yeah, the notes on the animus. Generator's holding up. Good job, Layla. The genetic sequencer blueprint. Never got the creases out. Going back in. This is so badass. Be careful. Protect this great land. Alexandria is where the snake thrives, and Aya lives. I must find them both. Yeah. Yamu. Home to my old friend Menehet. He will be in the temple. He always is. Out of my way! Get it. 
Jai, great warrior, come. I sell you what you want. You need it, I have it. If I don't have it, you don't need it. Redda has your back in these desolate lands. You are but a boy. How did you come by such fine treasure? Plucked from the ancient lands of the desert, the sunken vessels of the Nile, refined by handmaidens of the gods. Weaponry forged in Nubian mines, Persian jewels, and Assyrian treasures. I have it all. I see. You are well-traveled for such a young man. Old wisdom, Neb. I have acquired from long nights in the desert with my camel. I will see what you have. Come, look around. If you want good Neb, I have other jobs too. me! <laughs> Have you seen my Book of the Dead in your travels, Medjai? I went all the way to Memphis to buy it. No. How was it lost? Bandits. They came from the dunes nearby. When their leader saw how I cared for the book, he wrenched it from me. I thought my heart would stop. I can help. I do not fear them. I have been praying for someone like you. That book will unite me with my wife's spirit. There you are, Father. We are going home. But this Magi is helping me. Oh, yes? You are going to find his book? If by some miracle you do, thank you. Did you hear where the bandits meant to go? Oh, I... The lead... told the others to meet him at the necropolis, I think. We live nearby. Thank you. You have given me hope that I may be reunited with Isis. Turn the book to the old man.
as your father left us. His good life is over. He was too weak to live till you return. May he be conducted in peace. He was in despair that his car would not join my mother's. Where is his body? It is not too late. You are a blessing from the gods. He receives the rites in this small temple. May the field of reeds be open to you, Father. My position get it. Oh, old man, your book. May it guide you to your wife's side. What do you need? Last night, my dear husband Claudius took a boat out to see the ruins across the lake. He has not returned. None of these brutes honor a wife's pain. I beg you! I will seek him out. Do be quick. I will await you here. My dear husband. <laughs> are dead. Now to speak to Claudius and find out why he came out here. Why did you kill them? We had only just met. Claudius, you are drunk. Yes. That is me. And no, I am not. I had only two or ten beers. All right. Let's get you back to your wife. I have a wife? Oh, oh. mother will be so pleased. your reason for going out there, Gladios? I was going... Mm, remember. I came from Alexandria for the festival. And some kind of... Uh, someone offered me to drink all night uh, for free. Impossible to re resist. What were we talking about? How you got here. Oh! Right, then I woke up here with those crocodili all around. Tell me, can they really speak? Egypt is a land full of magic and ancient mystery. Amazing. My friends in the city will never believe it. Did you say something about a wife? 
Uh, yes, yours. See, I do not understand that. How could I have a wife? I am a virgin. At least I think I am. I will hear no more on this subject. You can take it up with your wife. But you do not understand every woman I've ever tried to... Th Please, shut up. Oh, I am sorry. This fresh wind off the river is good for me. I am feeling... There you are, my dear. I was worried about you. Oh, my Dionysus. I remember. I went to the island because of her. She... She got me drunk, married me, told me I owed her a virginity tax. Whose virginity? You can go. This is between me and my husband. No, 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 don't, don't go. They'll kill me. Future, be careful when drinking with strangers. I will never drink again. A scene of death. I should investigate. Sekhmet, the goddess of hunters. But there are scratches here, above the statue's stomach. What does it represent? <laughs> Scraps of a message. Ah, there's too much missing. Was this a terrible ceremony? There is so much blood, as if some butchery occurred here. But the elements have eroded many of the signs. Scraps of blood and flesh. There was a body here. The crocodiles must have devoured it. <laughs> the lid of a sarcophagus. There was a symbol here. But it is too damaged for me to make out. Troubling. If I had more information, I might understand this better. But as he was eaten by a crocodile, I'll keep my eye out for anything else so unusual. Fortune. I thought it would be years before we saw you again. Hail in peace, Menahet. How is your family? <laughs> the children seem to grow larger by the minute. My wife and I have our hands full. And you? Is there any news of... None. I forget myself. There are so many things in your life best not spoken of. Forgive me. I see by your garb that you have been promoted. Ah, yes. The High Priest, in his grace, made me his second. And my rank is not the only thing he has changed. You must see the temple. You will give me a tour? Of course, of course. At the moment of your pleasure. Ready to see our beautiful temple? After you, Menehet. Or is it servant of the goddess? Men ahead will do, for one as good as family. This is far from the sorry ruin of my last visit. <clears throat> Yamu now plays constant host to ceremonies showing our rustic way of life, which attract many visitors with more gold than sense. 
Uh, a description well suited to Alexandrians. How does this sit with your faith? I confess that my thoughts are sometimes uneasy. by a gang of ruffians, huh? Silent as gifts. Uncle Bayek! Uncle Bayek! Hello, Uncle. Jewels of my life, why have you left your mother's side? Pick me up, Uncle Bayek! Ah, see now, there's no need to attack a man from behind. We're not numbering him four to one, huh? You told us to secure every advantage possible over a dangerous four. Yes, yes, yes. And I am very dangerous! <laughs> Hide well, for the wanderer stalks your path! <laughs> you found me! Your time to hide! Come away from there, Nyla. You're getting in the priest's way. Nyla, are you following me? Asina, you must come down from here. Only the priests are permitted here. You know that. Yes, but I want to see. Hush. If you will not to end at the hands of the mighty gladiator Soris. Soris, stay back! What are you doing down there? I wanted to hide, but now I can't get back out. I'm scared. Stay calm. I will help you out of there. This way. Through the tunnel. Thank you, Uncle Bayek. Good. That's the last of the children. abouts in your market and you claim you can do nothing the dealings of the market are beyond me speak rather to the offending merchant <laughs> priest you have proven as false as your mummies men ahead your brood is delivered safely home thank you friend hey, what did that fool want with you some visitors having purchased religious objects are angry when our village has no more dead cats to sell them though not a merchant I am often the means by which the aggrieved snuff their anger. This matter needs a firm hand. That was the fourth tourist this week to shout at me. Do you know anything of flawed mummies sold to tourists? If you are not here to buy, I have no time for your questions. Menehet, the priest, is concerned about the... And I am concerned about my business, so keep your distance. Oh. <gasps> Greetings. I am... You have come to the right place, Neb. We have everything you could possibly want. What I want is to ask about false idols sold at the market. 
I have heard rumors of such, but there is nothing to them. Now leave if you want to avoid trouble. Tell me of the fake mummies being sold here. I have no desire to be dragged into this. Menahed sent me. Your silence is an insult to his holy office. Uh, I wish to anger neither him nor the gods. We are forced to sell items of lesser quality. Or see our stalls destroyed. Who is behind this? I can say no more now. Let us meet tonight, where the village turns to farmland. We can speak more privately tonight. Outside the village. Find me southeast of here. In the fields. I'd better return at night when we can speak freely. Glad to see you have kept our appointment. Come, sit with me and share a drink of wine. I do not have time for that. <laughs> it is a beautiful night. Let us enjoy the coolness of the air for a moment before turning to business. Merchant, I am not here to take in the air. Who is behind the traffic of false icons? Well, you see, it is no simple story. There are many involved in this terrible affair, but they would all tell you the same thing. Pity the trusting man, for he suffers great pain. Seek evil, and you will always... <laughs> who fights as well as you can perhaps afford to be trusting. Talk, or you will meet the same fate as your friends. That will not be necessary. Among the dunes, southeast of here, is the bandit camp where the fake mummies are made. I suppose you would go and destroy it now. Better I smash the camp than your head. Destroying these forgeries will only favor the gods. For our lives. What a disgrace. I should be cautious around here. I'll kill you! Feels like we are being warned. Hey! Who goes? You're finished! Hey. 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 Scrape this road, hey, but of my boots. You will pay, dealt with the trafficking of false mummies. Thank you. How can I ease the burdens of an old friend? Tonight, we will stage a grand spectacle. Our goddess Sekhmet defends the people against Isvet's chaos. But Pamu, our champion, is nowhere to be found. The high priest will judge me responsible for his absence. I'll have a look. Sekhmet bless you. His home is near the market. But check the tavern first. It pains me to ask you for a further favor. 
Hamu does like a drink now and again. Stinks of beer. Oh, thank you. I've been trying to get him to leave for hours. Menahat. That is Pamu! What has happened to him? His passion for toasting Sekhmet has exceeded his head for drink. This is a disaster! People have come from the Red Land and the Black to see him fight! If a fight is all that is needed, I could replace him. Of course, Magi! You honor yourself in saving me from disgrace. Speak to the High Priest in the Temple Courtyard. He will take care of the rest. Your Holiness, I am here to fight for Sekhmet. You're not Pamu. He was meant to play Sekhmet. Pamu is... ill. He is recovering at the temple. Fine. Follow me. This is a friendly bout. We must stay vigilant. Do not fear. Sekhmet will receive a fine tribute. We give thanks for your presence on this sacred night. We invite your witness on the solemnity of our customs. We unveil to you a ritual that has guarded us for century upon century. Make for every eye years, to look really. upon the warrior for whom the two are. <laughs> Should malice cling too strongly to your hearts, Isfet, the evil one, shall smite the goddess ah! and condemn Yamu to a hundred seasons of darkness. But should your hearts be pure, the goddess shall favor us, shielding us from the obscurity of chaos! Let the battle begin! Sehmet the Lioness! Chaos will reign! Oh, 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 o
I could swear you were the blood eater herself. Ah. The priest's recounting of the battle between the goddess and Isfet was <laughs> new to me. It is a tale of his own invention. You will not hear it outside Yamu. Would that you'd agree to stay with us longer. But I know that greater duties call you. I'll say goodbye to the children before I leave. Do so. They'll miss you. You are always welcome in Yamu. Whenever your journeys bring you to our norm. Keep the mask and staff of the goddess as poor tokens of our respect. <laughs> 